Dynamark, get ready, he's it, go. Dark. Kelly's here. Wow. Kelly's here. Perfect. Gaming. That's amazing. Welcome back, everyone, to another episode of Raincoat. I'm Kelly. And I'm Zelly. And we're getting here today as Yuma Coco Hut alongside with Fubuki. So last time, we met the Resistance. Uh, we were resistant against joining the Resistance, but we ended up taking a side job to help put up cameras to help keep surveillance around the town. Uh, a long time this doing this, we did some mob soul missions, and we also found some Fubuki working at uh, one of the cafes here, too. So now we're teaming up with her to continue where we left off last time. So okay. I figured the WDO would benefit from a uniform with a similar design. Popular? Excuse me. Would you be willing to answer a survey? Well, me? I've got time, I guess. What do you want to ask? Uh, um, are you disillusioned by <laughs> Kane Ward's subservice to Amaterasu Corporation? Huh? Uh... Are you out of your mind? What would you do if the peacekeepers had heard you just now? You can get yourself in all trouble you want, but don't drag me into it. S sorry I'm sorry, I couldn't agree more. Let me see. That being said, I'm not happy about it. It sucks to always have to worry about who might be watching you. I wish someone could do something about it. We're gonna keep at it with that survey? Watch your back out there, okay? Thank you very much. We're right, thanks. Well, at least he agrees with us. Just want to make sure that we're smart about what we're doing, right? Mm hmm. Don't want to end up another corpse in the town here among all the mysteries we have. <clears throat> Whoa! Oh, it's you! Come on! Master, who is this girl? Did you take advantage of her? No. No. Why do you have to say it like that? And I have no idea who she is. Uh. I saw you with Karumi before. Are you her boyfriend? He wishes. Oh, he wishes. B -b boyfriend on. As if. Hey. K Karumi and I don't have that kind of relationship. Haha! -ha. It's the way you say your name. You're totally her boyfriend, aren't you? Uh, um. No, that's that. Don't try to hide it. I see right through you. Come on. She sure is persistent. And then. What's your name? Um, it It's Yuma, but Kurumi and I aren't together. Yuma it is. Uh, Seen as you're a love guru, I'd like to ask for your advice. <laughs> love guru? Ooh. Okay, okay, I like this. Love guru? <clears throat> My master, a love guru? <laughs> you can count on him. <sighs> Quit laughing. This chick sure is relentless. She's doing my respect. I... There's someone I like, but I don't know if I should tell him or not. He's very... What's the world? Aloof? He tends not to show a lot of emotion. But that's why I'm sure... Oh. That's why I'm not sure how he feels about me. <sighs> uh-huh. And then... So I'd like to see if you love Guru Yuma asked him for me. Huh? Huh? You want me to do it? Yeah. Yeah, you're both guys, so he might be more willing to talk to you. And since you're a love guru, I bet you could pick up on his subtle emotions. How about it? Will you help me out? Uh, um... I guess, if it's for the name okay. of love. Alright then, where can I find him? Uh, Around this time, I'm sure he's at the cafe. The Golden Path Cafe. Oh, where we just were? How hey, convenient. Hey, interesting. Okay, well, I guess everybody else has been drawn there too, huh? The Golden Path Cafe? That's the cafe in Ginma District. Yeah, hmm. that's right. It was on the way to that tall tower. Yeah. Okay, I'll go there then. But I can't make any guarantees. Hmm. I see. The humility must be one of your techniques. I should be taking notes. Aww. You're not getting through her at all. Let's just leave her be and head to the cafe. <sighs> Yeah, let's. Let's indeed. Troubles of the heart. Requested accepted. I like how it looks like Fabuki's just stalking us now. Like she's just literally tagging along behind us now. Where <laughs> we go. It's like a lost little puppy. Or like Robin to Batman, if you will. You know. Oh, is it him? 
He looks older. Excuse me. Excuse me, do you have a moment? Yeah. What is it? Uh, um, I was able to find it, but how do I even bring this up? You walked up to him without a plan? Get it together, master. Why not ask him straight up? You won't get anywhere tiptoeing around it. That's true. That's true. <laughs> yeah, that's true. We all said that's true. Oh my God. Hey, you in the hey, you watching this, do you think that's true as well? You might be right. Well, there's a girl who says she likes you. A girl from the academy? Hmm? You, you know her? Well. She's talked to me a few times before. I, I didn't know she felt that way, but I'm happy to hear it. Uh, what? He likes her too? Uh, boring. Well, come on, who doesn't like a happy ending? But. But thinking about how things are in Kanai Ward, I'm afraid I can't return her feelings. Huh? Huh? Hmm. Huh? He's lost in thought now. What should we do? Then... Hmm. Maybe we can find someone to give us love advice? For now. Then how about checking out Ginma District? Yeah. Sure. And if we don't find someone there, we can look somewhere else. I thought we were the love advice. Hey. So, how was it? You went and asked for advice, right? Yeah. Yeah! We're dating now thanks to him. I'm so glad I went for a consult. Oh. Ooh. I should go ask for a love consult too. I've been stuck in a rut lately. You definitely should. I think he's still at the Hotel Kasamaki District. In that oh. case. Sounds like someone who might know about romance. I should go meet him too. I don't know. It might be Desohiko. <laughs> uh, right, Desihiko was a romantic. Well, what if he was trying to find love and now he's trying to give advice for love? Would that be, would that draw people to him then too, for love? It mm. might actually, it might be a good, a good ploy. I mean, not to say that that's exactly what happened or what's gonna happen, but. Yeah, you know, the way we face through people here makes it seem like from uh, 13 Ages Sentinel's Rim where they're not, they're just AI. They're not actually here. Where are go? We're the only real person. Everybody else is a computer. Or not. <laughs> <laughs> well, we couldn't find the answer just to give him right away. So hopefully after this other love guru, we can get some more advice about what to do for true love. Oh, isn't this nice to have love in a crappy, dim, wet area <laughs> of a town? <laughs> That's kind of nice. Wow, it's really right in here, it sounds go. like. Go, go, go. There's like four things. Oh, do we have to do more of the survey here? Probably. I bet. Well, then we're still trying to find our other team members, so the questions are all just about finding out where the other people might be. Oh, true. Excuse me. Excuse me, have you heard a, a rumor about red rain falling in this oh. area? Oh. Red rain? What is that, an urban legend? I've never even heard of it, let alone seen it. <sighs> I see. Thank you for being useless. Thank you very much for not being constructive at all. Appreciate the feedback. It got us nowhere fast. That's right, the red rain is in this area, isn't it? Wasn't it like an alley? Um, excuse me, do you know anything about this red rain rumor? Hmm? Can't say that I do. Where'd you hear that? No. It's fine if you don't know. Thanks anyway. No problem, bro. Anytime. time. I feel that's like how he would dismiss it as like you leave the conversation. Mm -hmm. Come back anytime, muchacho. Wow, that's a depressing thing to say. Drop dead. Um, there are rumors about red rain falling around here. Do you know anything about that? <sighs> say what now? Never heard of it. I think someone's messing with you, man. Uh, <laughs> you might be right. <sighs> Looks like no one knows anything about it. Hmm. What's going on here? Did that guy trick us? I'll boom kill you! Deceiver, my master, will get you boom killed! Uh, a rumor nobody's heard about. He might have been tricked too. So I should ask him where the rumor came from. Hmm. That's true. That, that does seem odd, as a general thing to ask, right? Just red. 
Um, oh, is it in the hotel? I think that might be the, the love armor? advice girl. Okay. Let's get two birds with one stone, Kelly. Or as they say, two light bulbs with one rock. No, that doesn't help anything. <laughs> Maybe two darts at one board? Two darts at one board sounds better, actually. Excuse me. Do you have a minute? Um, I've heard that people come to you for advice on love. Is that true? Yeah, it is. Do you want a consultation too? No. Well, actually, it's not my problem per se. These two people like one another, but the guy doesn't think they can be together because of the way Kanai Ward is. And then, what do you think about it? Yeah. Well, if he likes her, then I think he should go for it. I see. I see. Ah, youth. What a wonderful way of thinking. <sighs> uh-huh. Hmm. Let me tell you a story. There was once a man and a woman who loved each other very much. But they never did it. The man refused. What does that mean? Why? Yeah. The man was a former criminal. He paid what he owed to society, but his history made it difficult to find a job. So he knew he couldn't be with her. If he was going to do so, it would only be after he worked, he found work. That's what he believed. But the woman didn't care about any of that. She told him she wanted to be with him even through tough times. Hmm. If only he had expressed his feelings to her. Hmm? Did something happen? Oh. The woman became ill and passed away. It seemed it was rather sudden. The man regrets it to this day. He wishes he could have turned her affection. I think this is talking about his story, maybe. Mm -hmm. The man he's talking about is... Tell your acquaintance for me. Don't let someone's feelings go to waste, especially in difficult times. That's right. You never know when it might be too late. Thank you very much. Right. Thank you for your advice. Awesome. Thank you. I love these little side missions. They're so much fun to actually kind of do, in my opinion, at least. This hotel's awesome. All right. So I think we did everything in this area for now for the optional menus and everything, I think. So we go back to the general menu. Oh boy. So we have Mano Menon District. I think for the red, we could do that for the red, um, red rain. Uh, Ginma District for the one we just went to. Well, I'm going to trigger the cutscene since we're right here anyway. This um, way. Oh, 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 for the next spot. Right, right, right. Yeah, why not, right? Pretty That's cool. For number three. Three. And after three is. Okay, I've confirmed the feed. <laughs> huh. The video quality is poor. Could it be the location or the cable? Let me adjust things. Uh, do you mind standing by for now? All right. Fubuki, we need to be on standby until we get further orders. We should move so the peacekeepers don't spot us. Understood. Sounds good. Let's wait under the overhang for Servan to get in touch. Overhang? Is this the overhang? Oh. I just followed the egg kinds on the map. <laughs> okay. <laughs> this silence feels so awkward. What should I talk about? About the weather, about the Clackford family, about detectives? Ooh, um... We could do the Clackford family. I lost my memory, so forgive me for asking. Is the Clockford family famous? Famous? Hmm, I am unsure about that. I believe only... Everyone <laughs> in the world knows about them. Oh. That's pretty famous. Do they run a Zaibatsu or something? Or are your family all politicians? I am not certain myself. But for generations, we have managed the world's standard time and make any decisions regarding time and calendars. Hmm. Whoa, that seems huge. Your family sounds like a bigger deal than I thought. So will you be taking over your family's work in the future? I cannot say for certain, but I did discover something after leaving home. It is far more fun to travel the whole world than to sit idle in a mansion. 
That is why I think I will stay an adventurer detective for the time being. Oh, okay. Hey, about the weather? Fubuki, what made you become a detective? Well, I am ashamed to say it, but it was my parents' instructions. I was not even aware of what detectives do. My mm. parents wished for me to gain some worldly experience. They practically kicked me out. <laughs> I soon joined the World Detective Organization, but even then, I was simply doing what my parents told me to do. And you were able to become a master detective? After the training and exams? Yes. Before I knew it, I had my detective deed. Before you knew it? Was it that easy for you? Wasn't it tough? I do not know. So much has been on my mind since I left home that I have not taken much time to consider it. The outside world is completely new to me. Everything is bright and shiny. Woo! I know all the neon lights around here. It really contrasts well with the dark more weather. About this new world. So I decided to become an adventurer. So that's why you keep calling yourself that. Hmm. Yes. There is nothing more exciting than exploring an unknown world. However, I do not wish you to think I am neglecting my duties as a detective. Finding the truth in unsolved cases is similar to going on an adventure to uncover a secret no one else knows. That is something both adventurers and detectives do. I see. Curiosity about the unknown is what drives you. Ah, perhaps that is it. For the first time, I feel like I finally understand myself. Hmm. Yuma, you are a great detective. <laughs> I just listen. No big deal. You don't want to do about the weather? No. Thanks for waiting. I finished making the adjustments. I managed to process it on my end, so there's nothing you need to do over there. Got it. Can we leave this place now? Yeah. Head to the next location. Oh. This is the last one. The last camera will need to be set up on the road in front of Etheria Academy. Hmm. Thanks. <coughs> it's Karuma wow. School. There shouldn't be a lot of people there at this hour. Should be easy enough. You know, Should be. They say time is lightning, so we need to hurry and strike. Um, <laughs> I think you mean money, not lightning. <laughs> no, time is lightning. I like that too. Never mind. Let's go. Right. I was right, right? Fubuki, I mean, yeah. Yeah, you are. You're not wrong. You're not wrong, girly girl. So give me a district. And we also have one at the Kanaya Tower. Oh, and do I do that one? Mm -hmm. Go for the uh, the red rain? Yep. Okay. <sighs> Sent in a goose chase about this and found out nothing to go off of. wonder who told him. I wonder if it's a higher up. I wonder if it's... Masurasu. Even the name sounds like a like a sword, doesn't it? Mm. Like a samurai sword. Mm -hmm. Matarasu. Like a spear within a sword. <laughs> yeah, this place is sick. This reminds me of like you're in a city and they had like a hall, like a downtown area. Just like it. Oh. Oh. <laughs> no. Watch out, Master. I think you're being surrounded. Um. Can I help you? Mm. Mm. Uh, well, I'll be going then. Huh. Where are the going, brother? Huh? Brother, what are you talking about? <laughs> the crimson red rain is a blessing. Those who seek it with our brothers. Believe in the red rain as we do. Hmm. Master, there's something off about these guys. <laughs> Let us trust them for crimson red rain. <laughs> seek the blessing with us. What do I do? What should I do? Fubuki, where are you? The crimson red rain will guide us to the promised land. Receive thy blessing and enter the promised land. <laughs> They're going to kill us, aren't they? They're going to get us if you don't do something. We have to <clears> run. <throat> Did we seriously just bolt past them? 
Did <gasps> we lose them? Oh. It doesn't look like anyone followed us. Say. Master, what? What's that? Huh? Huh? Give us a paper. Is... What the? Huh? It says, when next we meet, thou shalt best May made a, a brother, brother in truth. truth. They must have written this note. But when? <laughs> anyway, let's report back. Oh, God, that's creepy. That was so creepy. They're the same type of people though that are at the school, though. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Hey, you're back. Yes. Yeah, I ran into a bit of trouble. As for the investigation, rest assured, the Red Ring doesn't exist. Are you not going to mention those guys? But that would only make him more uneasy. <sighs> Red Rain doesn't exist? Yes. Yeah, so you can go to work without... Wor the Crimson Red Rain does indeed exist. Hmm? Huh? Is he a part of, of those dudes? Oh my god. Trust in the Crimson Red Rain as we do. Huh? Huh? Hmm. Master, this guy's... Brother, trust in the Crimson Red Rain as we do. Let us make for the promised land. Ah! <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. <sighs> it doesn't look like he followed us. Do we have another note? Say. The guy must have already been brainwashed. What does that mean? Seems like it. Just who were those people? But I didn't sense anything strange from them. So they're probably just humans. <laughs> That's more unsettling. Yeah. They generally believe some crimson red rain will save them. Why? Uh oh. What's up? What is it? Sh sure. Nothing. I must be imagining things. Oh, are they not there? Oh my god, that's creepy. Oh! oh! The crimson red rain will guide us to the promised land. Receive thy blessing and enter the promised land. You see his eyes underneath his oh my god. thing there? They're freaky. <laughs> What a freak. Rumors of red rain accomplished. Ooh. How was it even accomplished? That was, that that's was freaky. so creepy. Yeah. Oh, let's see here. We'll Gima District? We'll go to Gima District and then Can the tower. I tower? Ooh. Yeah. I wonder if it's uh, Makoto wants us to do something. Oh my God. I'm getting stalker vibes though from that. That is freaky though. Oh, that was so creepy. <laughs> It doesn't exist? No, it does exist. Receive thy blessing. I thought he was gonna like attack us right then and there. I know, I can't believe Yuma just bolted past them. I'm just like, I thought for sure they'd grab them or something. Like, are they are we, they're referring to the Crimson Red Rain as blood? Blood of people or something, right? That's what I'm thinking. I don't I'm know. guessing, I mean, what else could be red though, right? I know, right? I don't know. Maybe the, maybe the light's here? Maybe some type of food? I really don't know, it's odd. Oh yeah, the love guru. Yeah. Oh, it's you. I'm still not sure what to do. Uh, if you're still unsure, please listen to this. I heard it from someone more experienced with love. Oh. Don't let someone's feeling go to waste, especially in difficult times. Mm. Yeah. Come tomorrow. There's a chance you may not ever be able to be able to see that person again. If you have feelings for her, you should let her know. That's... Yeah. Yeah, you're right. Thanks. Because of you, I've made up my mind. I'm going to go see her. Yes. Yay. Yeah. Yeah, yeah! <laughs> yeah, yeah. I think that's a good idea. All right. True love will prevail. Well. Uh, um, I couldn't wait any longer. I didn't hear what you talked about. Uh, how'd it go? Uh... Well, I don't think I should be the one to tell her. And that's what happened. He wants to tell you himself, so he said he'd come see you soon. What? I... I can't let him see me like this. He put us something more cute. Yes! I'll thank you next time. Oh. Uh... Th there she goes. Ah. Okay. You mean love is such a pain. No. That's not true. It's just that people take love very seriously. That's why it's so beautiful. Oh, no. That's true. What? Master, have you become interested in love? 
No, no, no. It's much too early for you. <laughs> you haven't developed yet or matured enough yet. Oh, gosh. <laughs> A detective is married to the job. to solving cases and mysteries. Love is out of the question. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I got it. <laughs> wow. Dang, so are we technically married to Shinigami now, I feel like? Another 100 points. Heck yeah. Kanai Tower looks like it's the next one for the... For the trips here. I could just walk there, but taking the bus is so much more fun. I mean, right? I mean, if I could walk next door, I'd take the bus. <laughs> <laughs> well, I can't go there yet. I'm going to grab a lift real quick. Can I tower? Oh, it's at the entrance here. Excuse me. Excuse me. Would you be willing to answer a survey? Oh. A survey? Yeah, I don't mind, but what's it about? Uh, um, are you disillusioned by Kanai Ward's subservice to Amaterasu Corporation? Huh? Uh, oh dear. I didn't hear a single word of what you just said. Then... Then I'll say it again. She gonna sleep? Cut it out. The peacekeepers will hear you. S sorry Sorry. Wow. Of course I'm not happy with how things are, but it's not something you can talk about openly. Honestly, I wouldn't have much of a problem if the peacekeepers weren't so corrupt. Right. But as it stands, they essentially control Amaterasu. <sighs> I wonder if there's anything we can do. By the way, I'll never forgive you if you report this to Amaterasu. I'll haunt you forever. <laughs> like a, a certain someone that we know? I think so. Oh my god. I, I would never do that. I know, I feel like people think everybody's gonna sell everybody out, huh? No kidding. It's kind of a problem here, isn't now it? Now another one popped up? Yeah, because we have to ask around, I think, like every district, I think, right? So we travel around a little bit, it's okay. We went to Kanai Tower. I thought we were gonna see Makoto, but it wasn't him. Which, frankly, I'm okay with for now. Yeah, maybe he'll become more of a point in the story later on. Mm hmm. The son of number one is in trouble. Who knew? Hmm. Number one had he a could son. Be. He could be. Maybe Maybe it is true. How? You know, I, mean? you know, I feel like people speak the truth, but they always lie and joke about it in this game, though, too, I feel. Mm -hmm. Like, homunculi, they're not a real thing. It turns out they're going to be. Excuse me. Excuse me. Would you be willing to answer a survey? Um. Uh, who? Me? Or, um... Well, what kind of survey is it? Uh, um... Are you disillusioned by Kanai Ward's subservice to Amaterasu Corporation? I feel huh? like that's such a poor way to word that. But what? I, I could never answer that. It's too embarrassing. Huh? Embarrassing? Uh, um. You should only ask that sort of thing once we've gotten to know each other better. W why? I is that right? Told you so. She's worried about her friends might see her talking to you and start spreading rumors. Sh sure. Oh. You really think so? Yeah, that's right. I really think so. Um. But it probably wasn't easy for you to ask me, so I should give you a proper answer. I'm sorry, I just don't feel that way about you right now. What do you mean? <laughs> what kind of answer is that? Oh, you got shut down. Well, then... I do have those feelings, but I'm too scared to be more open about it. So I'm sorry. All right. I, I see. Thanks for your help. I don't think I explained myself very yeah, well. Yeah, no, the way you phrase yeah. that. That makes three people we should report back. The way you phrase it, for that just seems so hard to understand, I think. The clock tower. Yeah, drunk need to take you off the liquor there, huh, Kelly? <laughs> I was trying to select the icon. Plus it almost looked like it was on the other one. Mm-hmm, sure, With the sure. way it was positioned. Uh-huh, that's what you say after a few drinks of... <laughs> I don't of the poison water from the rain. Here. I don't drink. You drink water though, right? I drink juice and tea and other lovely beverages. I mean, I drink, I mean, I drink juice too, tea as well, water, milk sometimes. Hey, for those that are watching, why don't you comment down below? What's your favorite beverage to drink on any day? Let's see it out. Okay. Oh. Master, stop. Huh? Huh? Is he being questioned by the peacekeepers? Oh. That's enough out of you! This is a clear act of rebellion against Amaterasu Corporation. Yeah. I know full well what I'm doing, and I have no intention of stopping. What? 
bastard! He's gonna get punched. Yep. Uh, uh. You all right? Are, are, are you, you all right? right? Hmm. You're with him, are you? Come on! What are you doing, master? You'll get arrested! Sh sure. But, but... I don't know him. He has nothing to do with me. Huh? huh? <laughs> hmm. If you don't want to get hurt, then stay out of this. That's right. You have nothing to do with this, so get out of here. Uh -huh. Idiot. How could he say that? We went and talked to people just like he asked. No. No, he's trying to protect me. Hey. Bring it on! Oh, my God. I wonder how the weather in Kanai Ward tomorrow will be. That's it. He's asking about the survey. If most people in Kanai Ward were disillusioned, then. Seems like sunshine. <laughs> sunshine? What a relief. Then it's too early for me to call it quits. Ugh. What did you say? What kind of dumb crap are you spouting? It's going to rain all day, today, tomorrow, and every day after that. You're coming with me. Ugh, what a fool. There's no hope for him now that the peacekeepers have him. It's his own fault for defying Amaterasu. Are we still let it happen? I guess we had to. Just walked away. Shoot. What? Despite what those people were saying. Yeah. I have a feeling he'll be back someday. I just know it. As a homunculi. No, maybe not. Young hearts want to break free. All right. Although, oh, okay. That's putting us towards the next main mission here. Mm -hmm. So we've cleared, I think, all the optional missions right now. Yeah, all the side quests. We did all the side quests. Now get to get back to that main story. Etheria Academy, front row here. So no more lollygagging, Kelly. We mm -hmm. can't go on, take a restroom stop on the journey to, uh, you know, point A to point B here, okay? Time to get back to business. You can't call over for a restroom break. You can't come over to say, I don't, I need a break. I need to get out of the car. No, no, no. We're going to keep driving. We're going to keep driving until we get there. It's going to be an 18 hour drive, but we're going to get there. You're going to, you're going to wonder when Shinigami is going to be stopped being so jealous of other girls oh, that we talk to. I know. I'm like, are you jealous of their flesh and bodies? It seems. Oh, right up there, it looks like. Set camera. Oh, uh, turn turn for some time. Oh, interesting. Okay, so I think we are good. Let me just look up our list real quick. Yeah, I'm pretty sure we got all the memory shards. Uh huh. Uh huh. Uh huh. And Marma on that side. Yeah, for that. So there are only five for this one. I oh wait 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 wait. Uh, under a van in the car park, under behind the resistance hideout. When you get on the boat in chapter three, you can find this one on a box near the entrance to the power plant. Let's not continue. Let's go right now. Hit no. Um, and let's go back to the uh, Doya district. Um, this over here. Oh, I can't. Wait. Why not? I can't. Can we go back to the, can you go to the riverbank? And see if we can travel there, maybe? I thought we got that one. Yeah. Maybe we, maybe we can't fast travel there. Maybe we have to like, literally just get escorted there. You know how we were brought there last time? Kidnapped and shit? Mm -hmm. Oh, crap. I hope it lets us go back because this will be a nice point to come back to this before it is, in fact, too late. Uh, Riverbank. I, it doesn't let us. I thought we got this one because wasn't it this one right here? It was, but I forgot to look in the back here. There's two more that I wrote down that Why I wasn't aware of. Why did you write them on the back? Because it didn't have enough space on this side. Look. Then get a bigger notepad next time. Well, maybe we should buy some bigger notepads next time. <laughs> well, one says under a van in the car park behind the resistance hideout. Oh, man. Because um, I don't think we can go back to that area. No, I don't well, think. Well, actually, there's no bus stop, but what if we just port to the newest area. Actually, we could we are just, the nearest area. We could just walk to it from here, right? It's well, yeah, I think you have to go up, right? Not that spot. It has to be. I think it's the one that's marked off. This right here, isn't it? Yeah. Um. Oh, we can't go that way. Okay. Um. What about the other entrance on the right there? Hmm. Because they've fed a car through this area? It's hard to believe. Master! 
Where are you going? That's not the right way. Ah. Don't tell me we missed one just because. Because we got off the area. Ah. Maybe we'll be able to come back to it, Kelly. Who knows? We might be able to come back to it. And if we don't get every single one of them, it's not going to be the end of the world, right? No, but I would have liked to get out. I know, I know, I know. And I'm sure you watching too would appreciate that as well, too. But there are two more, hopefully, if we get the chance to after this to come back to it. it. Says we won't be able to come back to it for some time, though. So we'll see. You know, I have a funny feeling. I have a funny feeling. It's in, it's in somewhere. It's in somewhere, yeah. Yeah, it's a funny feeling. Sorry, love you. <clears throat> yep. Let's do it. Placing number four. That should do it. Servan, I finished setting up the surveillance camera. The video quality checks out. <laughs> Seems we're all good here. We got all four cameras up and running now. I don't see peacekeepers patrolling the area. And it looks like no one saw you. Great work handling this mission so quickly. <laughs> Detectives sure are reliable. <laughs> I hope the cameras help you expose peacekeeper corruption. That's right. I believe this is the first step toward peace. All that's left is to report back to Shachi. I'm sure he has other stuff to talk about, so do you mind telling him? The frequency for Shachi's transceiver is 37.564. Thanks. 37.564. I'll try to remember that if we do have to have that memorized. 37564. 37564. Or you could write it down. <laughs> okay. I mean, I guess I do have paper here. 564. Frequency. Oh, I guess I can turn the dial here. This errand boy quest was a pain, but it'll be worth it if you get info about Amaterasu. I'm glad there wasn't any conflict involved. <laughs> I was lucky to find Fubuki, too. Let's finish up and get back to searching for Chief Yako and the others. You know, it just occurred to me we're still in Chapter 3, so that doesn't mean Chapter 3 is over yet. So we still have a chance of getting that last one, hopefully. Right, correct. And that's what I'm hoping Shashi's we'll have a chance to go to. Chief's frequency is 37.564. Huh? Five minutes until detonation? What is this? Did Wait, what? Did we set up bombs instead of cameras? Wait, don't tell me. Is that thing gonna explode? That's a countdown, right? It, it'll explode? It's near the telephone booth in Marnamon District. That's where we set up the first security camera. What is the matter, Yuma? You look like you just pressed <laughs> the bomb's detonation button. <laughs> Wait, Master, you pressed it? No, I didn't do anything. Anyway, let's go check it out. Maybe this Wait. is some sort of prank. Fubuki, we're heading to Marunomon District. We need to hurry. All right. I do not understand, but it sounds like an adventure. What? So they're going to explode? The cameras you just put up are going to explode? That's what he made it sound like. I'm just okay. like, we set up bombs, question mark? I thought they were surveillance cameras. They I mean, look like fooled me, I guess. Surveillance, surveillance coming cameras, but they could have been this guy. <sighs> Servan, what are you doing? What what is going on? <sighs> we're being taken advantage of, I guess, right? Mm-hmm. This is what we get. <laughs> that sound. Oh no! Please let me be wrong. Explosion just now. Where did it take place? No. It was the phone booth. I know where that is, so follow me. Oh no. Oh my god. What the heck? Are they blown up pe like peacekeepers? Is that the thing? There's a lot of people near the phone booth. Oh, there's smoke coming from them. The phone yeah. booth's been blown away. Was that the explosion earlier? A public phone exploded. Maybe the batteries were overcharged. From the looks of it, the silver lining is no one's been injured in the explosion. There's something on the transceiver. What you heard wasn't some mere explosion. It is the call to rebellion. The smoke you see isn't just the smoldering ash of a stamped out flame. 
It is the signal for revolution. What? Is this the Red Rain or something? Message. Servan, can you hear me? Servan? Shachi, please answer me. What you're about to hear echo across Kanai Ward is the song of revolution. Revolution inevitably requires sacrifice. Beloved citizens falling as casualties cannot be avoided. However, death comes equally to us all. Equality is revolution. That being said, a revolution must also be fair. Thus, since you were the one to plant the bombs, I will also give you a chance to stop them from exploding. The one who planted the bombs? Me? Oh my gosh. So Yuma, you were not setting up surveillance cameras. <laughs> you were planting bombs? I guess so. You have set four bombs around Kanai. One of them just detonated. Oh my god. The first bomb was a demonstration, so the damage was minimal. But now you've seen this message is no joke. The bombs are real. And it looks like it's coming from like the surveillance this area. This is so long. I'm bored. I'll leave the rest to you, master. The bombs <laughs> will detonate in the order you set them up. You are the only person who can disarm them. Here's how to do so. When it's armed, move the transceiver close to the bomb and cut the detonation circuit. However, to cut a detonation circuit, you must perfectly execute the steps as displayed on the transceiver. Oh, circuit. God. You have 60 <laughs> minutes to act. Whether to disarm the bombs or not is up to you. But can Once we go back to Doya District? Zero, this transceiver will explode along with the bombs. Meaning, you cannot avoid death. Even if you ignore the people and try to flee, there is no escaping the revolution. You decide the future of... I wish you luck. Why? Why me? <laughs> you really get dragged into trouble all the time. Seriously. This isn't funny. The countdown's already started. If I don't disarm the bombs, then I'll blow up with this watch. Then just take it off. Oh, right. It's stuck, isn't it? It's stuck. You can't oh, move it. It won't come off. What's going on? Is it locked? Maybe it explodes if you force it off. Ooh. You should have mentioned that earlier. <laughs> yeah, that might be also a possibility. <laughs> Breaking news from the Amaterasu Corporation Peacekeepers. Hello, Ta, my slaves of Kanai Lord. Oh, Are my you God. Loving your happy, subservient life? It's your Peacekeeper Counterterror. Wow. We need a new character. Guillaume Hall. Interesting. Okay. The special party trick is fortune telling. Here it goes. <clears throat> Bad luck today for anyone with a Berenice's hair constellation sign. Some jealous baldy is going to kill you. By the way, the guy behind me is Dominic. As you can see, he's an absolute intellectual. Come on and say hi, Slowpoke. Oh. <laughs> oh my god. He looks like a cyborg. Dominic Bull Tank. Oh my gosh. Mm. Mm. <laughs> wow, that was kind of philosophical, you know? <laughs> I wonder if my slaves in Kanai Ward got that. Anyway, did you know there was an explosion in Marnamon District? How many died? None? Well, not like I care. The resistance caused the explosion in Doya District. The peacekeepers received their proclamation loud and clear. No. Look here. Read it, Nugget. <laughs> in summary, that's all there is. <laughs> Set up a bomb as an act of terror. But thanks to some leaks, we've already identified the perpetrator. Ta-da! Here he is. The Yuma. His name is Yuma. Oh. Oh, he sure looks like a terrorist, all right? Oh my gosh. As you know, Kanai Ward is a town of justice. Terrorists have no human rights here. Oh my god. There was cameras that could the, see us setting yeah. up the bombs. Was Were they working for... Everyone, kill him on sight. <laughs> the peacekeepers say it's A-OK. -okay. They make him look so evil in that picture. Hey, no kidding. underhanded rotten... Bottom-feeding terrorist bomber trash. You listening? 
You've got nowhere to run. Okay? Okay! Come on, do something, you nitwit. Oh. <laughs> oh. Is this a joke? Why am I... Hey, I think I recognize that face. Fubuki, you're not helping here! <laughs> Wait, I'm not a terrorist. I've been set up. A set up? So your client tricked you? That's all I can think of, <clears throat> since she said there was a leak. So Shachi and the Resistance tricked me? They took advantage of me? No, Sounds I like think, it. I th what I think is, I think that Peacekeepers actually got to them, found uh -huh. their location, and then they're, they're manipulating the situation in their favor. Mm. He spoke so passionately about peace. Was it all a lie? You won't fight them with violence. It would only lead to more lives lost. We're going to take them down the right way. The resistance are not terrorists. Okay. How could this be the right way? You were supposed to reject violence. They were pretty violent from the moment you were taken to their hideout. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Well, it's fine to be all sentimental or whatever, but you should take a look around. Huh. Did they already notice me? The explosion <laughs> countdown is still ticking away. There's no time to stand around and think. At this rate, you're going to end up dying as a terrorist. Yeah. I want that. We have to go disarm those bombs. Oh, but first, there's still time until the next explosion. We should visit the Resistance's hideout. You're boom killing them as payback for tricking you, right? Of course not. I need to talk to Shachi and find out the truth. Master, you still believe these people can be reasoned with? I... Yuma, is something the matter? <laughs> Are you sure we should not be in a hurry? For are you constipated? Me, please hear me out. Even if the next bomb is disarmed, there are two more. Right now, we have a grace period of 60 minutes. But we don't know if the same will be true of the rest. That's why we need to stop this whole plot while there's still even a little bit of extra time remaining. So you have a plan then? I'm going to see the client. If the client really is behind this, then I have to try and convince them to stop. I doubt it'll go so smoothly. Oh. Anyway, we have to act now. We can think about it later. Very well. Danger always accompanies adventure. <laughs> I'll stay by your side. Fubuki is so cool. <laughs> After all, we are the last survivors, partner. Thank you. Also, I still believe everyone is alive. <laughs> Resistance hideout was in Doya district. Don't come crying to me if this all goes south. Yeah. Let's go out to Doya, then. I'm assuming it's just taking us there, Yay! hopefully. Hopefully we can move freely. All right. Oh, we got the the cool the cool sound. We huh? can't use the bus or anything. No kill, we gotta walk. Shoot. We have to walk all the way from Monomoya District to the riverbank to Doya. So we gotta go to Ka Kamasaki. Can't we gotta go to the riverbank and then we gotta go to Doya District. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. And we can't use the bus. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yep. So Kamasaki District first. Push some so when they go through. Oh, almost. <laughs> God. Well, I'm sure it's doing this too because if along the way. To Shachi, he would understand. This ridiculous plan has to be stopped. Master, you are so naive. You were set up. No, I, I think you're jumping to conclusions. Sure Shachi had his reasons. This is why people keep taking advantage of you. Well, we also want to hear people out, right? Oh. There's a peacekeeper right we there. just walked past a peacekeeper. <laughs> nope, don't see him. I can't see him with these goggles eyes on my on my head here. <laughs> I'm blind to the truth. That's that's what they literally are right now as an organization. Peacekeepers are blind to the truth. They're like, oh, this happened. Sweeping under the rug. Not our problem anymore. Somebody else's problem. That's all I said, like Yomi, too, is it's like they figure out some mysteries. No, they're figuring out the mysteries. How could they figure out the mystery? Wow, you must be quite famous to be shown on such a big screen, <laughs> Yuma. Um, wait, you want to go underground, right? It's yeah, to be a wanted criminal. I need to find the staircase. Uh, I think it's all here. here. Yeah, sneaking around like this is the essence of adventure. I am all <laughs> fired up, Yuma. 
Yeah, are you? Really? Good, good, good. I'm terrified about being discovered. No, no, we're we're good. We're good. We're going back to our submarine. That is not there. That has been blown to smithereens by the peacekeepers. I mean, I thought it was a really cool hideout <laughs> to begin with, but I guess the peacekeepers knew it was there all along. Well, it just shows you the the, 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 mili the military might that they have, right? Master, it looks like that resistance woman hates your guts. Be careful, or you'll become full of lead. I'm pretty sure we're going to be regardless. That's a scary thing to say. <laughs> I don't know, should have got me so, so many different contrasting things, right? Mm -hmm. No corpses found, oh darn it. <laughs> oh, there's no blood, darn it. Oh, but the rain's nice here. Oh, that's cool. <laughs> I hate these ugly chicks, they're not that cool. All this like negative optimism, which is so weird. All right. Okay, oh, you know what, maybe we can Look around. I don't know where that parking lot would be. Like in a bigger area? So under a van in the car park behind the resistance hideout. Oh, see where that exclamation mark is? You want to go over there? So behind here, yeah. probably. Yeah. Oh, wow. If we can. These must be the ruins of an ancient civilization. <laughs> Not really. Most people would just call Doya District the slums. Oh, I see. Apologies for my ignorance. I suppose this is a lifestyle where you stay in harmony with nature. <laughs> Wait, Fubuki. Those are peacekeepers. Huh? Yeah. Peacekeepers are on the move after that explosion. The client's hideout is up ahead. We need to move carefully so they don't see us. Fun but times. Why did the resistance issue a declaration anyway? They would have known this was going to happen. I'm telling you, they're covering their pants down. They were trying to take a tinkle. Didn't quite work out. <laughs> it was bad. It was bad news bears. I still hope we can get to the spot we need to get to. So, we're we gonna get on a boat here? I don't know what we're gonna do. Okay. Uh oh. There's the fugitive! Fubiki Hell? They found me. What do I do? See? This is why I was against the plan. We have to lose them. Fubuki, please follow me. We're running. Right. Get back here. Huh? Okay. <gasps> Time. <laughs> I don't know if you can see my face when my eyes are super open. Oh my gosh, she can rewind time? She can rewind time? Wow. <gasps> oh my god. Huh? What was that? I didn't do anything. Yuma, the peacekeepers are catching up. Find some place to hide. Right. Oh great, we have to hide again. Oh. We don't have to choose this time. We. Those are the peacekeepers who just surrounded us. Fubuki, was that your forte? It feels like time was reversed. Hold on, it wasn't just a feeling. Time really was turned back. Huh? You noticed? But I should be the only one who can detect the reversal of time. Yuma, are you also of the Clockford family bloodline? <laughs> Are you my long lost brother? <laughs> Ooh, maybe. No, I'm not. <laughs> but I do have the ability to share another master detective's forte. Specifically when we hold hands. Oh, right. I was holding your hand back then. So you can share fortes. I see. It appears my maiden secret has been exposed by you, Yuma. <laughs> it is true. I can reverse time. That being said, the amount of time I can reverse is limited. Mm. Also, the amount I reverse is proportional to my fatigue. Even now... Are you alright? Yes, I am fine. There's no need to worry. I can still move. Interesting. 
I get now how this airheaded sheltered skink got into the WDO so effortlessly. She just oh. basically, if she failed, she just reversed retook the time the and again, just right? retook it again. Oh my god. Turning back time is an insanely powerful ability. Mm. It far surpasses human limitations. And if someone were to kill her, she could just pe just reverse time by a couple minutes and just get out of the situation, right? If she's not dead. Yeah. <laughs> People with abilities like this, I'm gonna fade into the background. Yeah, I know, Shinigami. <laughs> pretty useful for a voting <laughs> Did you see Shinigami she just, just poofed? She just pooped and disappeared. <laughs> so, is it okay if we continue to hold hands for now? Just in case. By holding hands and receiving permission to share your ability, I can turn back time too. You can do that? After all the training I had to do, <laughs> I knew you were no ordinary person, Yuma. But do we really have to hold hands? I have never held hands with a man before. You just did it, Fubuki. Oh, you're doing great. Don't be so shy, girl. You're doing great. My ability won't work properly otherwise. I see. I understand. Thank you. In that case... <sighs> What's wrong, Master? When our hands met, I sensed Fubuki's fatigue. Oh. I guess turning back time is extremely straining. Even if the power is amazing, we can't continue to rely on it. That's true. That's true. Keep moving carefully so you don't get caught by the peacekeepers. Oh, great. Yeah. Let's head to the hideout. Okay. Oh, dear. That's a peacekeeper? What bad timing. Uh, oh. left. Fubuki, now! Right Ooh, real time events. Understood. Wait, what if we just went forward and it's like running to him? <laughs> I'm like, I don't want to go forward. <laughs> that one's gonna be tricky. Uh oh. Well, that's the entrance. Somewhere. Ooh, it can't be Kelly. What's on here? Is that really a I guess it is probably the best call, right? Yeah. Damn it. Where did they go? <laughs> what? <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. Where'd she find those twigs? I don't know. Let's go while we can. Oh my gosh. Apparently this tree burned down. I got to use its branches. Wow. We finally made it. This is the resistance hideout. That wasn't so Fubuki, bad. Are you all right? Yes. Though I am a bit tired and my mind is a little hazy. <sighs> you should hide somewhere and rest. It might be dangerous inside the building, so I'll go in alone. But it's probably a smart move. I am your only surviving partner. <laughs> no, please, save your strength. I'll ask for your help when I need it. Also, everyone is alive. I'm sure of it. Ever since we've gotten here, we just kind of jumped to a cutscene once mm -hmm. I exited out of the map. <laughs> I know. If you insist. Very well. I will stay put and rest. Master? You're so kind. You never treat me like that. I want to be treated kindly too. <laughs> Ooh. There's no time. Let's go. Can we go around the back though? No, I guess not quite yet. All right. All right, fine. Makoto's meals. Always eating in the restaurant on the Corp cafeteria. He's terrible at cooking, so he never makes his own food. Oh, interesting. Almost always eating at the restaurants. I mean, oh. he could have. He's got a kitchen. He probably never uses it. It's probably you're right. Quiet. There's no one on lookout either. Is this the terrorist hideout? <sighs> Someone's here. Uh -oh. Hide. <laughs> yeah, that's where I would have hid. Their leader Shachi should be here somewhere. We must capture him at all costs. Oh my God. Hey, open up! Open up immediately! We know you're in there. Oh, he kicked down the door. The peacekeepers are looking for Shachi too. This is bad. 
Hey, wait! Oh, there he is. He's gonna escape from the roof and go down. Shachi. Stop, Master! If you go out there now, the peacekeepers will see you! Quick time event? What? Are we gonna try to reverse time? He ran to the roof! Damn it! He locked the door! Hey! Open up! Shachi ran to the roof. We have to get to him somehow. But how? Uh, well, the stairwell on the outside. It looks like the peacekeepers have forced Shachi. Huh? Are you gonna run? Not at all. Uh, Do you remember those emergency stairs to the roof? If Shachi ran to the rooftop, yeah. then he must have used the emergency stairs. Mm -hmm. Oh, right! So you're gonna get the jump on him. Hell yeah! Let's go catch that fraudster before the peacekeepers do and make him cough up the treat. Hmm. Yeah, okay. I'm down with that. Oh, Sachi. Please be okay. Or Shachi, not Sachi. I think Sachi's from One Piece. Isn't he the cook? He sure ran fast for such a big man. He is. And he did. I don't see Shachi around. Is he still on the roof? I should head to the roof for now. Hmm. Please don't be dead when we get up there. That's what I'm saying. Like, please don't be dead. Well, at least there are cameras and footage here. Oh, a gunshot. <gasps> Was that a gunshot? Sounded like it. Master, I have a bad feeling about this. Let's hurry. Oh no. I mean, Sachi did have a gun, so. <laughs> yeah, hopefully he was able to defend himself and not murdered. Oh no. He Sachi's dead. Sachi is <gasps> dead. I couldn't believe what I saw. It looks like he a shot, shot himself. The sight of which I still haven't gotten used to. Within that strangely colored pool, a corpse lay. A corpse that undeniably belonged to Shachi. His eyes were wide open, and a tunnel connected the two holes on the sides of his head. Wow. But stranger still. No one else was around. A gunshot just rang out. There was no place to run, no place oh. to hide. <gasps> There's, they're trying to get in still. Yet, not a soul was to be seen. I maybe mean, a sniper. He, he could have been sniped. And was maybe he's trying to shoot I'm back at the enemy. Open up right now! The was the gun just closed? On the other side of the door. It looks like it's still locked from this side. That means the only way to enter and leave the rooftop are the emergency stairs I just used. But no one came down the stairs after that gunshot. No matter how you look at it, this must be a suicide. Oh, or a sniper, maybe. <laughs> I mean, it doesn't have to be a suicide. <laughs> There's always other ways of how it could be framed, like we've learned throughout this entire game. <laughs> oh, we finally get a corpse and it's just suicide. That's no fun. Oh. Kaboom! My controller explosion? just shook and just scared the crap out of me. Ah! I see that. What? Another explosion? That one must be really close by. The countdown isn't at zero yet. So it's a different explosion? Besides, the next bomb to explode is the one at the cafe in Ginba district. Oh, I don't understand. What's going on here? Master, in times like these, you should look for the solution keys. There should be clues that help solve the mystery. Right. Nothing will be solved if I keep panicking. True, true, true. I need to investigate the scene and figure out what's going on. Exactly. So there's also two points of blood, too. See that? I'm already. Oh my god. I can still hear the peacekeepers banging on the door in the background. It's oh no. body. I think it's still warm. The holes in his temples look raw. There's no doubt that this was the fatal shot. Oh, oh leave the body's woods to me! Mm hmm There's no doubt he was shot. That's definitely a gunshot wound. Bullet penetrated his head and flew off somewhere. Looks like it entered through the right temple and traveled straight through the left one. 
to the right, but doesn't he have the gun in his other hand? No, but the blood splatter suggests otherwise. Yeah, if the bullet entered from the right... It should be entered from the left, not the right. I'm just trying to figure that out, because he's holding the hand- he's holding the gun with his right hand. Mm -hmm. Oh, and if he were to do a suicide. No, I believe you. Yeah, Shachi's corpse. Fresh wounds open at both temples. Appear to be the cause of death. Uh, parallel gunshot wound. So the gun's on his right hand, and mm -hmm. so if it was shooting that way, I guess that would make sense. Yeah. But what if it was the opposite way? Shachi's right hand is still holding the gun. Did he shoot himself in the head like this? I mean, it doesn't look like his finger's quite on the trigger, though. Right. Mm -hmm. Although there's... I recognize There's this steam gun. coming from it. Mm -hmm. It's the one Shachi took out of the safe. I think it was specially made for him. Dying to his own gun is a fitting end for a fraud like him. Maybe you should inspect the gun. You might find something suspicious about it. It's a revolver. There are six rounds loaded in the cylinder. Wait, on closer inspection, one of the shell cases is empty. Hmm. hmm. At the very least, it means one shot has been fired from this weapon. The muzzle is still hot. I can smell gunpowder. Maybe Shachi really did shoot himself in the head with this gun. But still, this gun is strange. Strange? How so? Try swinging at the cylinder. It pops out sideways. See? The cylinder swings out to the right. Regular revolver cylinders usually swing out to the left. Oh hmm. yeah, you're right. And yet this one swings out on the opposite so side. So is he a lefty, but he's using it with a right hand? Now that you mention it, it is opposite from normal ones. Hmm, even you can tell that much, huh? Maybe you held a gun before you lost your memories? I don't know. I do sort of remember the feeling of gripping a handle and the smell of gunpowder. It was probably just something I studied as a detective in training, though. For now, I'll remember the gun's features. It might be some kind of clue. Hmm. You definitely want to remember this. Yeah, because, like, why, if that were the case, it'd have to be in the other hand. Yeah. Can you move the camera at all? The right stick? I can't. I'm stuck on okay. this point. But I don't think there's anything else uh, that we can really look at. The blood at all? Look over the blood screen at all? No. Just yeah. have the two icons. Okay. Um, what about the blood next to him? Oh, are those, are those related, I guess? I guess they are. I guess that's just showing that how he got shot. Yeah. Oh, there's something oh. over here. Umbrella. There's an umbrella here. It's rusted, so it must have been left here for a while. Could it have anything to do with the case? I don't know. I guess we'll see for now. Not entirely sure. The neighboring building is taller than the hideout. There are no windows on the side facing us, so it'd be impossible to jump over there. But what if they were in something that flies? Like a hot air balloon? Hmm. The electrical lines would get in the way. Those look like high voltage lines. Oh. Touching them in the rain would be dangerous. I guess we can rule that out then. Maybe that's how the person did escape, though. If it was somebody that... Open know. up! Open up right now! There are still peacekeepers behind the door. Sounds like they're having trouble breaking it down. But it's only a matter of time. I better investigate quickly and get out of here. Hmm? What's this? There's a key? Seems like this is an exterior key for locking the door from the rooftop. It's still in the keyhole. Maybe Shachi locked it when he went out to the roof. The peacekeepers are behind the door. So no one could have passed through there after the gunshot. That's if it's a third party. And what if the peacekeepers got to the roof first? Hmm. After killing the guy, they went back and closed the door behind them to pretend it was locked. Hmm. But the key is on this side. It'd be impossible to lock it from outside yeah. after going back in. Right. Besides, there's no need for them to put on an act. Well, that's fair. That's a very solid point. Key on the outside, huh? Master, you gotta hurry! I don't think there's anything else here to investigate. <sighs> Anything along, along, along like the outer edges here? I mean, I kind of already walked around it, but I think we should be good. Oh, oh, there's something over here. Looks like it's a dead end. Oh, hello. What do we see down there? The roof is pretty high up. It's about 20 meters above ground. 
Jumping down from here will be out of the question. There's no ledge to stand on, and no sign that something like a rope has been used. Assuming someone climbed down using a rope after the gunshot, it would have taken some time to remove it. There's no way someone did that without me seeing them, since I got up here in 10 seconds or so. Wow. Okay. Uh, what is that? We are a parking lot? That explosion came from over here, I think. I knew it! There was an explosion in the parking lot below! It left a big hole in the hideout's wall, but there don't seem to be any victims. What was that explosion anyway? Could it have something to do with Shachi's death? Because the explosion was when we were in the stairwell, I think, right? Mm -hmm. Or, or was it when we found the body and then we heard the explosion? Oh, right there. Surveillance camera. There's a surveillance camera set at the entrance and exit of the emergency stairs. The camera faces the stairs, so it wouldn't capture anything happening on the rooftop. But if we check the footage, we might see if anyone used the emergency stairs. Then again, I didn't come across anyone when I came up here. I doubt someone involved in Shachi's death would show up on there. Never know, though. That should be enough. Oh, okay. Well, I guess we're told we are done. I Let's can't handle it. Just, I have to go take a look and... at Sashi. Let's check around his body. I thought we did. Did we miss something? I don't see anything. Um, I think it gave us the option to end investigation before, right? As like the three girls. We should just end the investigation. Finished. I think I've checked everything I can for now. Now time to close the case. Unfortunately, it looks like a suicide. After all, it was only around 10 seconds after the gunshot went off that you arrived on the roof. If someone was up here besides the dead fraudster, you would have definitely seen them. You're right. I doubt anyone was here. And if they were, where could they have gone? Unlike the clock tower case, it seems doubtful a rope ladder was used here. There's no place to edge a rope and no time to descend. It'd be super boring if the criminal used the same old trick. We can't say for certain this wasn't a repeat performance, but I think you might be right in this case. So, Shachi was cornered by the peacekeepers and committed suicide. Hmm. Oh, great. We're still up here, aren't we? Ah, they've broken through! This is what happens when you're so slow! Who are you? What are you doing here? Hey, aren't you the wanted terrorist? No! It, it's a misunderstanding! I'm not a terrorist! He... he's dead. So you fought among yourselves, huh? Terrorists murdering each other. You're all trash, out to ruin order! No, I didn't do this! Save it for later. You have no right to remain silent. No right to an inter- <laughs> Death and a terrorist together! <laughs> Sounds like a dramatic match made in heaven! I'm not a terrorist! <laughs> I'm just a training detective! <laughs> I just love how he just ran Death for it. Death detective <laughs> strikes again. That's right. Death detective... Strikes Bubba again. Key. Where are you, Bubba Key? They'll catch up at this rate! We need to run! Quick time events? There's a fork in the path! Wait! Stop right there! What do I do? Which way should I go? <clears throat> oh, crap. Uh... Uh, go to the right? Or left? This way. You said left? I said right. Oh, okay. Let's look up here. Oh! oh crap. No. Rewind time. Found you! Look at the perfect straw before us! You thirsty, Dominic? Let's dunk his head in the river, then suck the water out through his ass! <laughs> oh my god! That sounds uncomfortable! Run. 
Kabuki! Kabuki to the rescue! Huh? Did time rewind? It's just like when we held hands. Although I wasn't able to clearly recognize it. Is that sheltered skin nearby? It must be this way. <laughs> Thank goodness. Yuma, over oh here. Oh my god. Well, I'm glad we ran into her and not the other ones. <laughs> I didn't want water coming out of my butt. <laughs> it just sounded uncomfortable when she described that. I know, I'm like, this is so much force. <laughs> it's like out of her ass. <laughs> I can't believe she just turned back and looked at us like that. That was close. Oh! <laughs> well, in her boxes the whole time? <gasps> Fubuki, thank you so much. You turned back time to save me. I saw the peacekeepers were harassing you, so I went ahead and did it. Thanks to you, I escaped their clutches. It's heartening to know I've got a partner like you. Heartening? I was rather heartbroken. No matter how long I waited, it did not seem like you would return to me. Aw, Fubuki! Aww. We didn't mean to make you wait! We were doing an investigation, you see? We were investigating, yes. See? I'm sorry. Something unexpected happened. What happened? The client is dead. Huh? He was still alive when I arrived, but after being chased by the peacekeepers, he apparently shot himself in the head. A suicide? Seems like it. Then... it is my fault. Huh? If I had gone with you, I could have turned back time to save him. Mm-hmm. Mm. No. I think it would have ended the same way. I don't think so. It could have. We could have just rewound time and been on top of the roof when Shachi got up there. That's what we could have done. That would make a lot more sense. Because the emergency stair exit is like right next to the building outside. Everything was already in motion from the moment we arrived in Doya District. So you shouldn't feel responsible for what happened. <sighs> Thank you. I feel relieved after hearing that. I cannot help but think I was responsible. To be able to turn back time means she can even reverse death. That's a huge responsibility. It's too much for one person to shoulder alone. Yeah, seriously. I can't imagine all the regret and internal strife Fubuki must have dealt with. Now is not the time to get sentimental. The countdown is still in motion. That's true. Wait, I have to do something about the bombs. With Shachi dead, I'm the only one who can stop them. How much time is left? Fifteen minutes. Let us hurry and disarm them. They say to strike while the bomb is hot. Let's stop them while we still can. <laughs> it's while the iron is hot. While well, the bomb is hot. Mind. The second location is the Cathay and Ginma district. If it explodes, there's going to be casualties. We need to hurry and disarm it. Yes. Let us do it. Hand in hand. Oh, now that you mention it, is it okay for us to hold hands as we go there? Just in case? There are still some peacekeeper patrols around. I think it's safer if I can also use the power to rewind time. Well, if you do not mind. <laughs> so interesting. <laughs> Lives are on the line in this emergency, but holding a friend's hand. Oh. I know. A friend's hand is a good thing. It calms me down. Makes me feel like all will be well. <laughs> I feel the same way. Having a friend by your side is reassuring in times like these. You've never said that to me! And we're soul buddies! Let us depart to the <laughs> Cafe in Ginma district. Oh, if we can only get there. This place is still swarming with peacekeepers, isn't it? And it just takes us there. Aw, oh, crap. 
Here I was hoping we'd be able to walk to the place we wanted to go. <laughs> no. How are we gonna disarm it? Oh, that's right, they told us the way to disarm it as well too though. Mm -hmm. All right, well, we still have 15 minutes to go through. So hopefully we can disarm all three, hopefully the next like 15 minutes. <laughs> Man, we're gonna be sprinting. We're gonna be needing like a hot shower after this one or maybe like a relaxation for a bit. <laughs> Oh. B. This is bad. This way. Did you push B? I did. <laughs> that was a oh. close one. That was Kelly. so close. Might be another Kelly. Oh. Just my imagination. This is filled with quick time events. That's what this is. I gotta be on my toes. Cool. <laughs> yeah. I almost didn't push the button in time. Who I saw that. Oh my god. Why? Do you go a, a, a little bit wrong time? They're gonna see you. Hmm? There's someone there. Oh crap! Just say the button so that way Wait I can. There is someone heading this way. What hey! are we doing? Over here! I saw someone suspicious. Yeah, got it. I think they're the same voice actors, eh? Fubuki, now's our chance to get out of here. Right. How about the bomb? Huh? <laughs> Did we drop something? Oh, littering? Oh, there it is. The That's the second camera I set up. If this one explodes, the cafe will be heavily damaged. I may lose my second home. Not only that, depending on how strong the bomb is, it could affect all of Ginma District. We have to hurry and disarm it. True, true, true. Well, the screen on the transceiver changed. In order to disarm the bomb, you must enter the passcode. I shouldn't touch the bomb itself. I can disable it using the screen. Fubuki, stay back. It's dangerous. Please take care of like if I it. fail. Mm -hmm. No, I shall stay here. We can try again, even if you fail. But I can't control the screen while holding hands. How about this? Ooh. That works. Are you sure, Fubuki? I have prepared for this moment since our adventure began. Concentrate on disarming the bomb, Yuma. All right. Okay, no matter what, I need to disarm this before the time limit expires. Don't make me a widow death god. <laughs> a widow death god? Oh, jeez. Oh, gosh. Let's see. Select the correct answers in time to defuse the bomb. Any correct answers are or going over the time limit will cause the bomb to explode, so watch out. Okay. Uh, um, what goes in the question mark? Oh, gosh. Uh, so we have... Left top, right top, left bottom, left bottom, left bottom, right top, no, left top. Uh, so I think we have to find the correct one. So I think we want, okay, so there's there's a whole one right there. So we want the top right one, I think, just a singular top right. <coughs> I think. Bomb defusal. Press any button. Well, this will be a fun minigame. Ready? Ooh, we have full battery. Good. Start. Oh, it All just right. chucks right in there. Top left, top right, bottom right, bottom left, bottom left, bottom right, top right. So, I think... I need top right, that one. This one? Yeah. Oh, that's Disarming it. Arming code accepted. Detonation circuit severed. Confirmed. Detonation circuit severed. It's disarmed. Awesome. Success. I was looking at the way that the, the pie chunks were rotating, and I figured, oh, they all rotate in one direction, so the next one had to be that, even with you saying, oh, it's that one. Oh, well, I looked at mine, and there's four slices of the pie, right? One way. filled out a whole pie, and there are three left that filled out out of the four pieces. So we need one more piece, mm. and well, that was the it's missing too piece. Early to celebrate. Uh, for that one at least. Oh, okay. Huh? There are two bombs left. The next countdown has already started. But forty-five. Now minutes. the time limit is forty-five minutes. That is shorter than the last one, correct? Yes. It's like a game. Oh. It's not almost. They are absolutely toying with you. Otherwise, why make a mini game out of disarming bombs? I thought it was kind of fun, but okay. What's their goal in setting this up anyway? 
I was given a fake request to set up the bombs, and now they're making me disarm them with puzzles. They knew they'd get even more heat, and yet still issued a criminal declaration. What's their end goal? What are they trying to make me do? What is this is trying um, to do? Yuma, was no one besides your client home at the Resistance's estate? I mean, we didn't check the rooms because we just left right away because we were being pursued. Well, if nobody else was there. Me. I don't think there was anyone else at the hideout. If they stayed there, they would have been caught. Yep. If any of the late client's family were about, we could have asked them about the circumstances. You're right. The resistance leaders must know something about this. But since they weren't at the hideout, I don't know where to find them. The one named Servan hmm. designated the camera locations. I've tried calling him on the transceiver, but there's no response. I have no idea where he could be. If they were planning to screw you over from the get-go, then that camera guy must have played a role in it. I don't know about that. Maybe he cooperated without knowing the circumstances, like me. There Could be. you go, being a trusting doormat. If you are a detective, then you gotta suspect everybody. Anyway, let's head to the third bomb's location. Yes. The third one is in Kamasaki District. I hope the peacekeepers don't catch us before we get there. Oh, right, it's in the, uh, like next to the hotel. The, the vending machine, I believe, right? Yeah, it's above the vending machine. Um, Cause the last one's at the school. I'm just surprised that it was so easy, like they said too. Like, oh, this was so easy. This is great. Now they're actually bombs instead of cameras, <laughs> and now we have a time limit. And now there's a murder. Like, okay, can you put any more on our plate? <laughs> I'm pretty chuck full of goodies over here now. Yay! <laughs> Look at the bottom of this though. For being able to reverse time, that was sick. Like, if I could reverse time, I don't even know what I'd reverse time to. You know what I mean? I'd reverse it so I could eat my delicious food again. Delicious food? <laughs> yeah. Oh my god. Nah, nah, nah. But you I want a steak. Day. I'll eat, eat, eat my steak again. Yum, 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 yum. <laughs> so what if you could reverse time, but it didn't actually rewind time. It just uh, reversed maybe your movements or like around you. Hmm. Oh no. Oh. Quick time, Kelly. Oh no. <gasps> Found you! Shit. No! I didn't get to push a button. A can? A brick. Damn you! Uh, oh. brick. This. <laughs> I would love if you would have thrown this the, the can. That was a nice pitch. <laughs> chance. Oh I my mean, god! I knew the brick was gonna probably do more damage. Right. Oh my god! Are you see the guy walks up like, la di da di da. Nothing big deal here. You, you bastard! Oh, shit. oh god. <laughs> oh. Don't move. B. Damn you! Let me go! Oh. Hey, wait! Help me! Do we help him? Hmm. Oh. Hey. Yes. He's fine. <laughs> He's just I a little bruised. I Is got him. Thank you. I like how she like daintily on, used her pointer right. and thumb to kind of like pick him over the edge. Just like, oops. Oh. I love this. This is actually a lot of fun. <laughs> Oh. Who, who's there? You're too loud. It's Is me. it Kurumi? It's gotta be Kurumi. Yay! I love how my our outfit went from black to gray. We finally found you. Kurumi? I mean, she was stalking us before, so that was her disguise. Oh, you're right. It was, wasn't it? Yeah. <laughs> What's the black girl doing here? <laughs> Your screen time's already over. <laughs> <laughs> Shinigami can tell you're so thrilled. <laughs> of course. You might just attract a beautiful woman. I'm being no, afraid. It's a misunderstanding. <laughs> I know. I'd never doubt my hero. Why is she so friendly with you? Go away! <laughs> By the way, Yuma, despite everything going on, Ooh. you're holding a woman's hand. Guess you're not too bothered by it. Kurumi, are you jealous? Interesting, Kurumi. No, this is a formality for the investigation. Sort of. Pleased to meet you. My name is Fubuki. I am Yuma's partner. Oh, she's gonna- Don't phrase it like that! Oh, she's gonna misunderstand! I'm Yuma's partner. partner? Yes. In order to share time together, 
We clutch our hands tight to one another. Oh my oh god. Oh my god. Fabuki, she's so gonna misunderstand <sighs> that. Until Yuma dies. No, even in death, <sighs> I am sworn to never let go. Jesus Christ. <laughs> okay. Uh, um, please don't misunderstand. This is necessary for the investigation. <laughs> well, I keep saying that. I'm sure it is. Look at you! <laughs> Grinning while surrounded by girls. I hope pervy future criminal detectives like you all explode. <laughs> Maybe if it was Desihiko, but we know you must not like that. Yeah, I know. If it was only the difference. Right! I need to disarm the bomb! Huh? Bomb? <laughs> There's another one? Yeah, right where we're standing conveniently. Can you get it? I'm too short. There's one right in front of us. This is the bomb? What's going on here? There's no time, so I'll make it quick. <laughs> cha 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 cha. And so 35 minutes were used up and we only have 10 minutes to go. Uh-huh, probably. Or maybe five minutes five to go. Five minutes. And that's everything. You sound exhausted, Yuma. <laughs> Yuma, you got dragged into a big mess. You yeah, I did. are a master detective. Trouble seems to seek you out. <laughs> Everywhere you go, luck goes with you. More like bad luck goes with us. I mean, I'm nicknamed the, the death detective if that means anything. I'm not lucky. Hey, you got me instead of luck. <laughs> <laughs> anyway. So you only set up the bombs at those four locations? Hmm? Yeah, why? Interesting. So the flooding in Maranomon District probably has nothing to do with it. Flooding? Just a little while ago, a flood started in Maranomon District. Now it's over a meter underwater. Whoa. Should it be because of the first explosion? But the only damage back then was to the phone booth. I don't remember any pipes bursting. Yeah. I went to see where the explosion took place. There wasn't much damage to the surrounding area. But if it has nothing to do with the bomb, why is there flooding in Maranamon District? Hmm. Hmm. Oh dear. Yuma, perhaps our concerns should be for the bomb at hand. I believe we are running low on time. I know, you guys love to chit chat, but right. we have an explosive in front of us here. What does the, the time say? We need to disarm that bomb <laughs> right now. Kurumi, you need to get to someplace safe and hide. Yeah. I, honey, I will see you later. I have my other little honey here. Take care of things. Okay, let's do this. Yes. All right. Let's. All right. Let's solve this puzzle. Oh, God. Tell you ready? Yeah. Ready as I'll ever be. All right. Uh, ULD. So, what? Okay. So, we have up, left, down, right. Um, up, down. Wait, what? You said it yourself. <laughs> Down, left, oh, right. Oh, my God. <laughs> oh, my God. I didn't realize that was actual start of the letters. <laughs> I was like, what are you talking about? I'm like, I haven't solved anything yet. And you're like, oh, one left. <laughs> you made me realize Because that's the start it. of each of the letter of the words. Yeah. And the way. Okay. That the puzzle pieces were orientated was with the same with what like, the letters said. Oh. <laughs> I was trying to work out what it spelled. So I was like, what does it mean for up, down, left, right? It was just gibberish otherwise. What is it, Chico? Kurumi, you are here? Why didn't you run away? I wanted to admire you, Yuma. I wanted to see my hero. I want to do my part too. Of course you do. While you disarmed the bomb, I was thinking the whole thing over. And I'm sure of it. Something must be happening behind the scenes here. Huh? What do you mean? The strange request you were given is one thing, but isn't this Shachi guy dying also bizarre? That criminal declaration being immediately sent to the peacekeeper seems out of place too. All that does is hurt the resistance's plans. That's yeah. right, but... When laying out the facts on the surface, if something seems inconsistent, then there must be a hidden truth. I'm just repeating what my grandpa said, but I think it applies to this case. I see. I can't accept Shachi's death. I refuse to believe he would try to frame me and destroy the city. He didn't seem like yeah. the type who'd do that. So we have to investigate. I'll go and check out the Resistance's hideout. No. 
<sighs> oh, it's dangerous there, Kurumi. There's so many peacekeepers there. I think he's gonna tell her this too. My gosh. I hope he does. Huh? You can't go there. The peacekeepers are all over Doya District. Kurumi, if you're at least going there, can you pick up the memory shard that we forgot? <laughs> <laughs> right. I'm Kanai Ward's best informant. I'll absolutely get any info that will help you solve the case. Wait, you can't go there alone, Kurumi. It's too dangerous. Don't worry. It's not the first time I've taken risks. Once I'm done, we'll meet up at the hotel in Kamasaki District. The master detectives are staying oh, there, God. right? I'm up. Wait, Kurumi! There she goes. She sure seems lively. I'm a little... No, I'm really worried for her. But I have no choice except to trust her right now. Anyway, we need to handle the next bomb. The countdown has already started. This one is 30 minutes. The time limit got even shorter. Isn't this um, the last one? Is it the should next be. Is bomb in a secret shrine in the middle of a desert? No, it's at the school. No, it's in the shrubbery at Etheria Academy. Let's go disarm it. Babuki, are you with us? Or are you just up in the sky? She's a little bit of an airhead right now. Yeah, see that. Clearly. Oh, hold on. That's, I just remembered. One of the resistance leaders said he had a shop in Kamasaki District. Oh. I own a small shop in Kamasaki District. We might be able to find resistance members there. We still have 30 minutes, so I think we can make it in time. Should we go pay him a visit? I, I love how the bombs aren't even like an immediate course. threat. They're like, oh, the time. Detectives both seek out the truth. The time's inconvenient, but whatever. The bombs are no concern. We can make a quick side trip, right? Let's go shopping. <laughs> But where is this shop you speak of? Um, wait, what kind of shop did Margolau say he owned? The old guy who said he hated Amaterasu, right? Probably some old guy shop. <laughs> An old guy shop? Let's look around and see if anything fits that description. Fair enough. Great. Oh. So we're looking around for some old shop, Nicole. Yeah. Uh. Oh. oh my god. Oh, we found it. Ooh, antiques. That sure looks like an old guy shop. I was totally right. Hey, relax. I'm not going to hurt you. I just want to talk. Yeah. You're not here to kill me? No. Kill you? Of course not. Why would you think that? You probably think the resistance framed you. And you didn't? The request Shachi gave me has made me a suspect for terrorism. I... I know nothing about those bombs. I really don't. I mean, he was just the accountant for the group all considering. <sighs> right. You don't know? Listen, sure, I'd love to see Amaterasu get blown up, but I wouldn't take advantage of someone uninvolved. Revenge must be taken with our own hands, or it's meaningless. He's very poetic. Feel I like that, that way. But other members of the resistance may feel differently. I manage all the bones. If this was planned by the team, there's no way I wouldn't have heard about it. Okay then. Hmm. He's competent. This bombing is completely unrelated to the resistance. The only possible explanation is Shachi acted on his own. Shachi? But Shachi committed suicide on the roof of your hideout. But that was Sachi's code that they gave us. Yeah. What? Shachi's dead? That's impossible. It's true. I found his body. The peacekeepers were chasing him before he shot himself in the head with his own gun. That's not possible. Even if he was cornered. Shachi isn't the kind who'd kill himself. Wait, hold on. Did you say with his own gun? Is there something I should know about it? I think so. After you left the hideout to do the job, something happened. Hmm. Shachi had just returned to the office after mediating a fight. Oh, it's after right. that was done, he put the gun back in the safe and securely locked it. So what? You sure are dense. Are you really a detective? <laughs> what if Shachi's death was not a suicide, 
but a homicide. You think someone else took Shachi's gun from the safe and shot him? If that's the case, there aren't many people who can open that safe. There's still a chance Shachi took the gun out himself and maybe had it taken from him. No, the chances are far too slim because Shachi would never draw his gun. Since the gun was concealed, don't you think it'd be difficult to take it from him? Even if you were up close? It's true, yeah. he didn't draw his gun in front of me. In fact, it even seems like he actively avoided doing so. The safe was only recently brought to the office. Not many people know how to open it. Only the leaders in the hideout at the time knew anything about it. Of course. <sighs> the leaders at the hideout were Ikardi, Servan, Yuruka, and you, Margalov. I had nothing to do with it. I returned to the store after you left the hideout and spoke to customers the whole time. If you suspect me, then talk to them. I'm no liar. So he has an alibi. I'd like to check what the customers say, but... Yuma, we are low on time. I'm sorry, <laughs> Fubuki, just a bit longer. Margalot, do you know where the other leaders are? I don't know. I haven't gone back to the hideout since. What can you tell me about the other leaders? You want me to sell out my comrades? Oh my god. <laughs> I thought he'd do that. We're not trying to sell them out. If only the leaders could have taken the gun and murdered Shachi, then they're all suspects. If one of them did murder Shachi, wouldn't you want to know? After all, that's why you told me about Shachi's gun, right? Mm. Oh. Fine. I'll tell you. Who should I ask about? <laughs> you just do Margalaw himself. Can you tell me about Iruka? The only woman leader in the resistance. She's unruly with no glamour or charm. She has a ruthless personality too. I hear she was once a competitive shooter. She and Shachi often trained with firearms together. Hmm. As you know, Shachi never tried to rely on his gun. What do you mean by competitive shooting? Handguns, sniping, clay pigeons, rifles. She's an athlete who can use anything. Shachi's gun was specially made. It was designed by Aruka. It's ironic that it was used to take his life. Hmm. Competitive shooter. Right. Well, hey, thank you for joining us here today. We're going to stop it right now just to kind of keep this a little bit more simplistic and kind of catch us up next time. I'll just realize this thing says fraud. Mm -hmm. <laughs> um, but thank you for joining us here today. We're a terrorist right now, apparently. And things are not looking too good. So join us next time as we pick up to try to, uh, I, well, unframe ourselves, try to find out who the culprit is and see what happened to Sachi because it is not looking good. And He's disarm the, the last bomb next time. I've been Kelly. Oh, and the last bomb, you're right. I've been Zelly. And it's... we'll see you next time, and thanks for watching. Bye bye. bye. Hey, Kelly, they stayed to the end. I know, Zelly. I think they like us. Like, like subscribe, or share to show us you care. Bye bye. bye, -bye.